Despite the cold, despite the rain, they were waiting in line even before the voting station opened. There's been an enthusiastic turnout in this neighborhood where many people believe they would be better off with Russia. It is like a holiday for us. I was born in the Soviet Union as part of Russia and we want to go back there. I would vote for Ukraine, but because of that self-proclaimed government and all the mess, I will vote for Russia. The referendum was organized in a hurry and without an up-to-date electoral register, so some people didn't get their voting cards. People have to choose between two alternatives, union with Russia or greater autonomy from Ukraine. Keeping things the way they are is not an option. The Prime Minister of Crimea cast his ballot early. He's in favor of union with Russia, but insists there's no pressure to vote in a certain way. There is no pressure on the people. You can see for yourself. People are free to vote. Personally, I don't feel or see any pressure. The security forces who are staunchly pro-Russian are never far away, a reminder of who controls Crimea right now. The first results will be announced shortly after the polls close. But among the people we spoke to, there was little doubt about the outcome.